All right, SMT Nation, it's your boy, the SMT. This is part two of my millimeter wave testing. Interesting thing just happened. The iPhone is not picking up the ultra wideband and the Pixel is. As opposed to my last video, I'm at the same exact site and I came to test. There's the Nokia millimeter wave. All right, so this time the story is different. There was a couple of updates that have come to the phone recently. But that wouldn't explain why this one is no longer picking it up. I don't know why, but now it's picking it up. And actually, it picked it up from pretty far away. So I'm going to just do a little bit of testing and see what we got going on here today, if the testing is the same or different. But there has been some updates that have been happening, so I want to give it a whirl. But um, yeah, we'll see how it performs. This one still hasn't picked up the millimeter wave, so I'm going to reset the modem. I'm gonna go ahead and flash airplane mode. I'm not sure why. Hopefully it picks it up, it should. Sometimes they just gotta be reset. Yeah, I picked it up, there you go. 5G ultra wide band. All right, so this one, 692 down, 56.5 up, 21 millisecond jitter, three millisecond, or three millisecond jitter, 21 millisecond ping. All right, we'll go ahead and get this one started. Uh, we'll run this one as well. Last time, I think I got like 1.4 gigs on the iPhone, maybe. Anyways, this is not like the greatest gear. I, I don't like Nokia. The Nokia gear isn't great. Um, I like the Samsung much better. I know Ericsson's the best, but Samsung's pretty good. Uh, I got to do some of that testing. I'll be at the bakery this weekend. I'll do some more of that testing. Sheesh. Uh, wow. So I do like... I do like what the Pixel does with sub six gigahertz. It's pretty good. Like I'm saying, it, I think it's gonna be a three gigahertz phone. I think it's gonna be an awesome C-band CBRS phone. It also does better with the uplink than the iPhone, which is important to me. Uh, best of both worlds, you'd like to see it doing better with both, but. Okay, so there's 681 down and 55 on the up for the Pixel 6 Pro. And then there's 890 down and 18 up. And the ping times are almost the same. I don't really see much of a difference there. Let's run another one. And then I'm going to run them separate. We'll run them both at the same time. This is just not good, guys. I don't like the Nokia hardware. It's just not good. But there's not much of a difference in this testing. I don't know. Okay, now it is. All right. All right, we'll go outside and we'll do some testing. I'll actually get out of the car. We'll see how it performs. Open some windows here first. All right, so 666 down, 55 up, and there's 1.3 gigs down and 40 up. So again, the uplink better on the Pixel. We'll see if going outside makes any difference. antennas aren't that good because that made a huge difference in the downlink capacity on the pixel I do think that the iPhone's got the better antenna hardware I'm pretty sure that's probably the case I've always liked what the iPhones have done with the 5G millimeter wave antennas all right so this time 1.2 gigs down 30 up and then 1.3 gigs down and 22 up for the iPhone Let's run them independently and see if we get anything there. Pretty much the same. 1.3 gigs down. 38 millisecond ping, 10 jitter. Uplinks in the 30s, approaching 40. So that's the Google Pixel 6 Pro. There's the iPhone. Yeah, it's faster. 
that's more typical of what I see. So it looks like maybe there weren't any major updates that came. Maybe, because when I first started testing it, it wasn't that good for the Pixel. So I'm, hope, you know, cautiously optimistic that that'll improve. Hopefully it can get to the iPhone level, but something tells me the modem's more like a 2020 modem for Qualcomm. Apparently Qualcomm has some things on their side that give them the advantage of millimeter wave, but I'll continue to test once I get on some Samsung gear. It'll be probably a little bit different. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, subscribe for more. Check out all the links in the description box. Comment down below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Peace.